Hey guys, it's Maggie. I want to do something a little bit different today with you and I want to share, um, I guess kind of a day in the life video and show you just kind of what I get up to every day and what my days off of my day job look like and how I spend those. And usually um, I start out every morning by, or I try to start out every morning by sitting down and reading a few cards and doing some journaling. So that's what I'm doing right now. I have my little Rider weight deck that I really like and then I also have this book that I really enjoy that I've been studying with. The Tarot Fundamentals by um, Loscarabio. Los Yes, Tarot Fundamentals. This is an amazing, almost like textbook for tarot cards and I absolutely love it. This is my altar setup for right now. I have a little opium incense burning. My Hecate candle and my other two candles that I like to leave on there. And this is still from midsummer. This was a little tequila that I poured for everybody. I'm letting them fully enjoy that. So usually I take a walk at some point today and I'll probably do that still, oh, Siri's listening to me. I'll probably do that sometime, but I'm waiting for a package to come that uh, my best friend in the world has sent to me. So I gotta hang out and wait for the UPS lady to get here. Hello, this is Poopy. This is my baby. Poopy turned 11 this year. This month, she turned 11. And this is Pebbles. I think Pebbles is like six or seven. Hey girls, Oh. So I have a little bit of a dilemma. This little guy who was ejected from his nest and to stand outside for a while. I was watching the mockingbird trying to figure out where he came from and then I saw his nest laying on the ground under the fig tree, so. I put him back up there, he's in his little house, so we're gonna go back up and see if his parents will come check on him. I wanna talk to you guys for a second about something um, I know that I struggle with and that I'm sure that a lot of you also struggle with as well. And that is um, a lack of focus and having a hard time staying focused on uh, things that I want to work on and um, things that I want to accomplish. And the anxiety and depression that can come with, with that. Um, I started noticing how bad my, I started noticing recently, the last year or so, how much time, or how much I struggled with trying to stay focused on a task. And I think that this, it may even be some like undiagnosed uh, like ADD or ADHD that I might have. Um, that was never really <clears throat> addressed whenever I was a child because I know that I've always had a hard time with like spacing out. Um, even in school, I would have a hard time listening to the teacher if they were talking about something, um, like lecturing. I just almost could not pay attention. Like I wouldn't act out or talk or anything, 
but I would just start to daydream about whatever. And luckily, like I was pretty, I was smart enough that uh, if there were things that I missed, I could um, teach myself how to do things. And so I ended up doing well in school, and I think that's why it was kind of always unaddressed because I wasn't unruly. Nobody ever really took the time to pay attention to the problems that I had with uh, focusing on tasks. And whenever I started to take uh, Witch and Moon, you know, my, <laughs> sorry, my little business uh, seriously, and I started taking extra time off of work so that I could um, put more time into my online business and you know, making videos and stuff for you guys, I noticed that um, I was struggling a lot trying to trying to complete things and find things that I wanted to focus on and expound on those things. And a lot of times that's probably why you'll find that some of my videos are so much shorter because it's really hard for me to express um, exactly what it is that I'm trying to convey to you all at you know one time. So it ends up being um, kind of a shortened <clears throat> Kind of an abridged, abridged version of what I want to talk to you about, and then if I do want to go into more depth about it, I can uh, write a blog post, which is a lot easier. But like today, whenever my anxiety is worse, I have a much harder time focusing. And I started thinking about it because I'm really anxious about that UPS person coming, almost to the point of like I'm obsessing over it. And I do that because I know that I could easily just like wander off and start doing something and I would miss her showing up. And this is something that I have to sign for and I really don't want to miss because I'm looking forward to it. And that has like thrown off my entire day. See, that's why I have a lot of cuts in my videos because I just totally lose my train of thought. And like I said, it's really difficult for me to get a thought out to like say what's happening in my mind because it is just fucking like reeling and I have all these things that I want to say and that I want to articulate and whenever I go to do it it's just blah like I I just have a really hard time getting that out cool it looks like you have a little devil on your shoulder and an owl <laughs> woohoo it's here it's here it finally came so excited Computer, what the fuck are you doing? Why you do this to me? That's any cute. His name is Boo, like Boo Radley. Most of the time we call him Booby. And we have the worst dog names ever. One of the things that I'm really focused on right now, as far as my own practice, um, is uh, learning the tarot and working with the tarot and just trying to get a really good grasp on that. And I showed you that book earlier. That has helped so, so much. But I've been trying to find a way to kind of incorporate it into my channel, my YouTube channel. Um, that was a little bit different than what other people were doing. You know, you can't be totally original these days, but um, I did you know, I didn't want to do just like weekly readings or that kind of stuff because um, I feel like that's already very done. There's plenty of really good channels that do that. And I didn't want to go over just regular card meetings because, um, you know, kind of the same thing. There's a lot of people that already do that. So, part of my discovery today was um, how I'm going to start incorporating tarot into um, my channel. And I really love the idea that I came up with because it's about um, using tarot with astrology and the moon signs and that just makes it very cohesive for um, the other stuff that I put on my blog and the stuff that I'm interested in daily. And so I'm really excited to um, share all of this with you guys and what I'm learning with you guys.
Well, I hope you all had a really wonderful day following me around. I'm about to go cook some dinner with my lovely hubby and enjoy some Mr. Robot on Amazon. And I will catch you all later. Stay weird.